Hey everyone, so I'm back with another video, and this is a haul video of makeup that I picked up from Dwayne Reed and Walgreens, so let's get into it. The first thing I'm going to start with is a lip gloss that I got from Family Dollar. So these are NYC New York Color Lip Glosses, and this first one is a 537 B-Way Berry, and I absolutely love these glosses. This one actually gives you a red tint, and all of them have fruity, fruity flavors and scents. So each of these lip glosses were $2 each from Family Dollar. So this one is B-Ray Berry. And the next one is 532 Park Avenue Punch. This one gives a more of a pink um, peachy tint. And then I got a clear one, which is called Clear is 530 Clear as Candy. Right there. And so far I've been using all of them. They give great shine because I have it on right now and they haven't stripped my lips so that's a um, aim of, in my book and the next thing I got from Family Dollar is this LA Colors eyeshadow this shadow was $2.50 and this one is called traditional and here are the colors And I absolutely love this. I already used it a couple times because I was looking for um, another neutral palette, just a small one, not the big old jumbo one. So this is my second natural palette. My first one is actually from Avon. And I totally forgot that I had it and I just found it yesterday. So I was super excited, but I actually used most of the colors in this palette. And I love LA colors because they're super pigmented and it's affordable. So I've used almost every single color except for about four or five colors and I love all of them so this LA colors traditional 12 eyeshadow palette just 250 from family dollar and the next thing I got from LA colors again so this is the five color metallic eyeshadow palette and this one is darling So I absolutely love these colors as well. Here are the colors. Now I absolutely love all of these colors. Um, they're very creamy. And I love that they're metallic. I actually do like shadows that have the shimmer in them. Um, I actually just bought my first like matte eyeshadow palette um, at Dwayne Reed. So I'm going to show you guys that in a minute. So all of these colors are extremely beautiful. Um, to me, they're very girly and simple, which I really like. And they're very pigmented. I like all of the colors. So the white is just like a powdery shimmer. Pink is extremely soft. I love soft pink eyeshadow. This color is really nice. It's a soft tan color. Kind of reminds me of like a camel color. It's more earthy. That brown is actually the prettiest brown I've ever seen in eyeshadows. So this was $2 from Family Dollar. Once again, that's LA Colors Darling. And the next thing is um, the items that I got from Dwayne Reed and Walgreens. So at Walgreens, I purchased... What did I purchase? At Walgreens, I purchased uh, six things. Remember I told you guys that I do not have a lot of blushes. I actually only have one that I use, which is from LA Colors. I actually did a haul on that 
last year. So I picked up two blushes from Wet n Wild. They may look exactly alike, but they're not. Um, one is Pearlescent, Ro wait, Pearlescent Pink, and one is Mellow Wine. So Mellow Wine right here is more of a matte color. And when I saw it, I was I love the color of this. This color actually looks better than the um, the LA Natural blush color that I bought last year. And then this is the pearlescent pink. So the pearlescent pink, they may look exactly alike, but the pearlescent pink actually has shimmer in it, which I really, really like, which will give you the rosy cheeks with a little bit of a glow. Um, I really like this color. So each of these blushers from Wet n Wild Color Icon was $2.99. I'm really excited about these. And then the next thing that I purchased is a Wet n Wild 8 palette. So this is my first 8 palette from Wet n Wild. And I just I just had to pick this up. And I think I more picked it up for these three colors right here. So this palette is called I Love My Matte. See, I got my first matte palette, and I absolutely love all the colors on here. Everything is actually super pigmented. My favorite colors are the green and the blue, hands down. Everything is really, really great. Um, uh, Wet n Wild's blacks or metallic darks like this or grays, they stain, but whatever. But these two are my favorite colors of all on Wet n Wild now. Once I've seen these two colors, I'm like, wow, that's beautiful. So let me just take a swatch for you guys so you can see it. That blue is pretty. And the green. The green reminds me of a sea foam. Um, and the blue reminds me of like an ocean color. So I absolutely love these two colors. I'm really excited to use this palette. So this is the Wet n Wild color icon. I purchased this for $4.99 from Walgreens. And this is the Love I Love My Matte Palette, and I just, yes, I love my matte palette. Let's just leave it at that. Um, I can't wait to use it, so I'm super excited about that. And the next thing is, this is actually, I'm going to show you guys um, some liquid eyeliners that I purchased from Walgreens, and then I'll show you the last thing that I purchased from Dwayne Reed. in my fingers but anyways so I picked up the wet n wild mega eyeliners I actually love wet n wilds mega eyeliners um, I'm just waiting for them to come out with like a hot pink and a silver <laughs> and a gold because I actually have the other colors I think the only one that I don't have is brown I don't think you'll be able to see brown on my skin so this blue is beautiful. I don't remember what the name of it was, if it was just blue or royal blue, but I picked it up because you can tell it's super bright, and I was excited when I got home that it was actually bright. So here's the brush. It's actually like brush with hair. Um, it's actually pretty precise, not so bad. And let me just show you the color. So this... Uh, mega eyeliner from White and Wild was $2.99 and this is the blue right here. That blue is extremely pretty. I really really love that blue. So the next eyeliner I bought was the purple. Um, the purple is okay. It's not so bright. I feel like it should have been bright like this nail polish color right here. But it's not. Um, let me just show that to you. This was also $2.99. So this purple, it's like a dark purple. It has shimmer in it as well. It's nice though, but I, I wish it was um, actually brighter. So here's the purple. And it's not bad, but I wish it was brighter. And then the last thing I purchased was this um, Wet n Wild H2O. So I was testing it last night. I've tested it before, and 
it's actually this marking right here it's extremely hard to wash off as you can see it started fading um i have put it on uh around 12 p.m yesterday and i've washed my hands all day and all night and it's just now that it's starting to um fade a little bit so this is h2o proof i have not tried like um oil makeup remover because I actually don't have any to see if it will remove but this soaks into your skin extremely fast so this is not something that I would recommend for a beginner in um, liquid eyeliner um, eyeliner because it soaks in so quick and then if you wanted to rub it off you can't it literally stays as soon as it dries bam that's it <laughs> that's the end of it so I guess I would only recommend this to the experts and so forth. I haven't tried it yet on my eye and I'm actually scared. So this is the Wet n Wild H2O Proof. This was $2.99. This bottle is actually bigger than the other liners. And then the brush feels like a felt tip but it's extremely pointy which I really really like and I'm guessing it's for um, precise obviously if you want to be precise with your liner also I'm thinking you can draw with this on your eyes if you want to do like a cheetah print or draw tree branches it's very very the point is very very small for you to do that so I think that's great for those people who are extremely artistic with doing all those different kind of looks so this was $2.99 and this is just dangerous if you're a beginner don't do it until you have mastered <laughs> applying your eyeliner perfectly or perfect enough because as soon as it dries you can't rub it off um maybe you can try the oil um, makeup remover or makeup remover wipes and see what happens but I'm scared of this for now <laughs> I'm gonna get me some oil makeup remover or something and see if it works that way if that works then at least I know if it dries and I make a mistake it can easily be wiped off but this is dangerous <laughs> and then the next and last thing is um, this is my second eight palette and I purchased this at Dwayne Reed in the city. So this is the Black Radiance Eye Appeal Shadow Collection. This was $7.49 and I got it for $6.49 because I had a coupon. And I absolutely love all these colors. I don't know if I've told you guys, but I absolutely love purples and pinks and shadows. So when I saw this, I definitely had to pick it up. Um, just like Wet n Wild, everything is super pigmented. The black stain as well. There are, what is on here? There are matte pearl, metallic, and sparkling finishes for you to mix and match. And I think that's why I like the eight palettes so much because you can mix and match the colors. And I absolutely love that on the back. They kind of help you with whatever look you're going for. If you want chic, you just use one color. If you want a seductive look, use one and two. If you want a bold and sexy, use one two and three and then if you want the dynamic look you use all four colors of whichever side you're interested in so I really really like this so this is black radiance got it for $6.49 and this palette is actually called posh plum and I really really like this color so I absolutely love these two palettes I love everything that I've got so far and also I'm actually doing a little um, I'm thinking of doing depotting my shadows because all of this is taking up space all of this is taking up space in my makeup drawer and I need to declutter I don't like to be cluttered with my um things so stay tuned for that hopefully the beginning of February I can show you guys that and then that's it that concludes my haul for makeup I hope that you found the reviews helpful if I helped in any kind of way um, but I absolutely love all the colors um, wet and wild LA colors and black radiance are brands that I always go to always 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 because they work for me if you have any questions or comments leave them down below and I'll definitely get back to you Thanks for watching this video, and I actually have another haul video coming up for nail polish, so I'm going to show you a couple of nail polishes that I picked up, and then that's about it. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.